a little bit different review here. I have the nice cooler from BJ's I purchased, 38 quart. Doing a review because I haven't seen any reviews on YouTube at all about this one. I just read the reviews that were on BJ's. Some were good, some were bad. One of the main ones says it couldn't hold water. It would leak. So we're gonna try that out here this morning. It, it has these little file openers here, left and right. Good added feature. It's got to be able to lock it. It feels uh, hefty and sturdy. It's got the rubber pads at the bottom. They pretty much copy Yeti from the outside. It's got the ropes on the side, just like Yeti, like the 35 uh, and then the inside. Good size. This is where you gotta wonder, right here, along the edge. This is where the rubber meets the road, as they say, when it comes to these kind of coolers. If it keeps the seal. Same type of setup here. Drain plug here at the bottom. So we're gonna tighten this boy up and we are going to fill it with water. And then I'm gonna turn her on her side, see if she leaks out. I'm sure she can hold ice for a while. Probably not as good as Jetty. So price-wise, it's only like 70 bucks on BJ's versus Yeti, which is about like 300, but I put the price up. But on there it says, stay dry, no sweat, quick drain, built-in lock, mount, water bottle opener. And there are your dimensions there. All right, my assistant will help fill this up. We need to get up a little bit higher and then open. All right, we'll come back when it's full. All right, it's about halfway full. So if you were full with ice, this is about how much water you would have left in there. So let's seal her up. Pull down and in. All right. All right, nothing leaking out of here, which is good. All right, here we go. Yep. So if that falls over while it's in your car or however you got it packed, you're getting wet. Oh, whoa. All right. That means I'm returning it. Can you get me a We should. I missed out. So if you guys were around on Prime Day, uh, they had Yetis, the uh, Carolina Blue Yetis, I call them, on sale. I wasn't sure which one I wanted, the 35 or the Roadie, so I went to Dick's, left it in my cart, made my decision, went back to the car to make a purchase, and they were gone. So I snooze you lose. Roadie's like 200 bucks. You can get on GovDex for about 170, 167. All right, open it back up. Try again. Seal it down. Make sure it's sealed. All right, hop off. We can. A little bit. All right, let's try the back side. No Back side. You see that leaks. So if you guys own Yetis. And this doesn't happen with Yetis, let me know if it's common. This includes a review of the nice 38 quart. I think it must be BJ's only because the other nice uh, coolers you see have the little pressure release over here. I guess it doesn't need pressure release since it leaks, since there won't be any pressure. Also, their quality control is not that great. That's how I dented over here when I first got it. Yeah. All right, we'll try something else. 